Hey, what's happening, Rangers? Welcome back to another Pooh Rangers Battle for the Grid. Oh, yeah! Brand new DLC is out for Season Pass 2, at least Woo! on the Nintendo Switch. We have Eric Myers, yeah. the Quantum Ranger. Quantum Power! Oh, yeah! So, if you guys have seen our Power Rangers stuff before, we always do arcades on the brand spanking new character, and Eric is out right now, as well as, get this, the character is also available in Power Rangers Legacy Wars with a completely Ooh. different moveset, and Daniel South is reprising his role, so he no does way. the voice in this game. I'm super psyched. This awesome. is my first time playing with it. Smash that like button and tell us your favorite Power Ranger in the comment section below. Let's do this! Ninja kick the like button! Alright, so we're gonna bring in Jason as our backup. And Gold Ranger. Powerhouse. Now, I don't know if there's a new stage available for Eric yet or not, and the White Ranger skin, I believe, has been moved to November, so it's not out. And Dai Chi is also moved to December. He was supposed to come out in November. That's not happening right now. I'm not just any ranger. Not by a long shot. Okay. I'm excited. Three, two, one. Alright, Eric, let's see what you got. So the actual Quantum Ranger's voice is really in this game, then. And Virgil from Devil May Cry. Oh, okay, cool. All right, I like his moveset so far. Ouch. Come on, Daniel. Let's go. Let's go, Eric. So Eric is a really powerful six ranger, but I know what you're thinking. He's like a red ranger. What's going on? Well, he just had to show Wes up. <laughs> Also, in real life, um, Daniel and uh, Jason Font have, like, this huge, like, kind of fun rivalry. They're, like, frenemies. Oh, okay. Not not to the kind of, uh, we'll say, extent that ASJ and Tommy <laughs> have been known for. Like, yeah. it's a playful rivalry. Ah, uh, I see. So they could sip tea together if they wanted to. Okay, so I brought out my saber sword. My quantum sword, or whatever it's called. It looks awesome. Your lightsaber? What? It's, I don't know if it's <laughs> a... Quantum sword! Oh, yeah! That was a little bit different than uh, the other super moves we've seen. It wasn't actually like a real super move. That's okay. Acceleration. <laughs> Whoa! It looks like you're coming in and out uh -oh. of like, quantum field there. Ah, oh, Quantum Ranger goes down. Maybe you shouldn't have gone up against Cat Ranger there. Yeah, I know. Swipeity Swipeity was. She's pretty intense. Let's say that. Yeah, I mean, he looks really cool. I like his outfit and everything. He looks great. Oh, uh, I can't believe he died in his first thing, but that's okay. I mean, it's great to have another Red Ranger on here. Like, I was. I really thought Lauren was going to be the next Red Ranger, though. To be honest. Yeah, that's okay. I mean, I bet they're probably going to have her in here eventually. Probably next year. Uh, the, the last character this year is going to be Daichi. Yeah, I just, I mean, I understand they probably have a limited number of characters they can put in this game, oh, but... new character animation for Jason! Whoa! Did you see it? I kind of saw something different there, yeah, definitely. It's pretty awesome. So they're adding, like, more personality for the Rangers, that's kind of cool. Yeah, I mean, I would love to see, like... Four or five Red Rangers in this game. I think Lauren will be the last one. Oh, personally. okay. But I mean, I don't know how many Rangers they're going to add in this game now, to be honest. But Eric looks so cool. He looks awesome. He's smiling. Well, his helmet is. So, like uh, Jason, he also has a Tyrannosaurus uh, Zord, but it's called the Q Rex Zord. Oh, cool. It's pretty I'm awesome. Not just any Ranger. Not by a long shot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it sounds really good. Yeah, that's Dan. Cool. I've always wanted to meet uh, Daniel at conventions because he's really fun with fans. Like, he gets really into it because he's also a voice actor. Oh, yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, that's cool. Well, yeah, I mean, that, that would be really neat to actually be the Quantum Ranger, but then also the voice of Virgil. Like, people would... Oh to my gosh! People would be able to recognize your not just how you look, but your voice. I wouldn't even know what it looks like. I don't even know what it looks like. Either. I need more quantum power. Quantum divide. Oh, sorry. Okay, so I have like a little quantum super divide. gauge there. That's my quantum divide. So I mean, his his super move is different than other guys. 
I really have to mess around with it. Usually when you hit the, the super button, it goes into this extravagant, like, animated thing. I don't know if they're going to change that later, because they did change Ranger Slayer's uh, super move. Yeah, I mean, not all of them have a extravagant super move. I feel like Lord Zed has the most extravagant super move, like, out of everyone. I need more quantum power. Which makes sense, because it's Lord Zed. Yeah. But I mean, some of, I feel like some, a few of the rangers just have a basic super move. Let's see how he does against. Uh... Ooh. Love that. Oh, you're taking tree. Oh, never mind. We're not having Eric die again. Come on, Jay. You got this. Come on, Eric. Oh. It's it's Jason. He has again. to recover. Yeah. We're just having a uh, Jason come in to even the odds a little bit. Well, I mean, it's so cool to see we've got two Red Rangers in here already. I know. I just need one more Red Ranger and I got a team of Red Rangers. I know, right? That's going to be so cool when you can have a team of, like, Pink Rangers or a team of Red Rangers. It'd be really awesome. We only need uh, one more Pink Ranger to have, like, three Pink, mm -hmm. one more Red. And like I said, guys, we don't know when the Tommy skin's coming out. Uh, it could be coming out for Halloween next week or we could be looking at november sometime which interestingly enough little power rangers trivia for you did you know that tommy's white rangers uh costume actually debuted like um in november so oh wow in the second season of power rangers i'm not awesome. just any ranger not by a long shot with the power of snow i'm pretty sure it did well yeah his voiceover you can tell he's a voice actor because the emotion that he has in his voice is like so much different than a lot of other like people that are just doing their line like as themselves it's almost like he is a character now <laughs> oh wait no i take that back i just remembered there was a uh, halloween episode with the white ranger in it so um i believe he made his debut in october like end of oh, september okay. early october that's cool the power transfer episode was thanksgiving of that year Ugh. Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, that uh, peace conference episode. Worst episode ever. Uh -oh. Epi the episode where every child watching cried. I was like, why? The smart ones. Why are my heroes gone? What happened? And every yeah, everyone else was like, it's fine. Uh, they just went to a peace conference. They'll be back. I don't know if I really like his... Um, his I, I liked his animation before for the sword. Like, for his counter thing. I mean, he does look more imposing like a powerful jason but i don't know i was just thinking like i wonder i don't know if saban had kids but like if he did have kids i'm just like i want to know what it was like trying to explain to his kids like it's okay sally they just went to a peace conference and his daughter's like what i don't understand i don't think he i don't, I don't even know if saban has kids i mean yeah. he might probably or they're probably a lot older want some power Oh, wow. That's crazy. Yeah, that's cool. I really like the look of his um, super moves, though. That's awesome. Whoa! Okay, there we go. So there is another move set that available once you have the Quantum Saber out. Nice. Wow! Eric is amazing! Oh, he can shoot from the ground? That's awesome. Well, his, his sword basically turns into his gun and vice versa. And he does all kinds of cool things with it. I mean... When Eric came on the scene, crazy stuff would happen because he's just so powerful. Oh no! Yeah, don't don't let Eric die again. I want to see more cool things that he can do. Does look super powerful. He did appear in the. Um, Any last words? I mean, he looks amazing as a modern looking, more modern looking Red Ranger than Jason, but. There's nothing that beats the original Red Ranger, like when Jason is- Oh man. Tommy versus Jason again. No matter how powerful a ranger is, they're just no match for Tommy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it seems exactly. that way, doesn't it? I do have to say, though, just even though we are showing off Quantum Ra Ranger, yeah. like, Quantum Ranger does his lines like a voice actor. Jason does his lines like he's a superhero. Yeah. <laughs> like he is. What <laughs> time? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Pretty, pretty powerful. Oh my gosh. No, I, I wish I could do um, 
Dan Justice like playing as him. The character is very technical based, but he's so much fun to play as. Yeah. I love him. He's really awesome. I love this pose here and stuff like that. It's really I'm cool. Not I just any ranger. Not just not any ranger. <laughs> oh, Evil this Jason. is a cool like matchup. Because you guys are both red and black. Yeah, I mean he looks great on the on the screen. Like I think it was a great pick for an addition. So did you see this coming? Did you know Eric was gonna be the next one they were gonna do? Yeah, they announced oh, okay. him oh, right that's when they right. announced season. That's right. You were talking to me about season that, two. saying Quantum Ranger is coming. So I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh. I just didn't know what Quantum Ranger looked like. So awesome. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. Bye, Jason. Oh, never mind. I got too too cocky there. Now it's bye, Jason. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. Gia. Gia just takes no prisoners. Well, ever. Maybe we'll have to go see him at a convention sometime. He goes to a lot of conventions. But, like, mainly Power Ranger conventions? No. Anime convention. He's a voice actor. Just like Johnny. Oh, okay. Oh, so fun. I love this game. And uh, just so you guys know, the character was not provided to me early. Uh, I have to wait for when the season pass comes out, just like the rest of you guys. <laughs> so. Yeah, so when you guys see Luke playing it, it means it's definitely out. Yeah, usually, except... Uh, it's been a great while. I thought it was actually going to have to do it on Xbox this time, but yeah. I'm so glad that it updated on the Switch because I, I just love my Switch controller so much better. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking myself, like... Uh-oh. The... Oh, that's right. I had Gold Ranger. I forgot about that. Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean, I think they're going to probably add some more moves for him later, to be honest. Oh, that's cool, though. Wow! Formation airplane! I like how his moves look super unique. They don't look like anybody else's moves uh -oh. that we've seen so far. Well, that's the great thing about Battle for the Grid. Mm -hmm. is they make all the rangers so unique. That is the best thing about Battle for the Grid. And you guys, don't forget to check out Quantum Ranger on Legacy Wars. Yes, he is in Legacy Wars, too. I don't know how I'll be able to look at that character, but I'd love to. At least we could tell you guys about him. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm guessing he'd be kind of similar. Of course, there are sometimes differences. Sometimes the moveset can be a little similar. Well, it's a different type of game, so like... I need more quantum power. Mm, look at quantum display. Formation quantum display. Yeah, I am getting a kick out of listening quantum to him voice over his part, though. Sounds That was such a big deal. Well, a lot of people thought Wes was going to be involved, but like I was saying, in the comic book, which is based on Battle for the Grid, like, you know, they adapted that whole Shattered Grid event. Mm -hmm. um, the Time Force Rangers were all destroyed except for Jen and Eric, and Eric was the one who came in for the final battle uh, uh, with Jen. Awesome. Yep, but we didn't really see him much. He was there. It just, you know. I like how his, if you look at the difference between Jason's helmet and his, his is smiling. Yep. So, Austin St. John and Dan are actually I'm pretty good friends. Oh, cool. And they met uh, during the Power Rangers Forever Red episode. Awesome. Which uh, was the first ever, like, big anniversary special that had, uh, I believe it was 10 Red Rangers. Wow, that's awesome. And the current show that that was part of was Power Rangers Wild Force. But Eric and, uh, I believe Eric and Jason didn't team up in that episode. Jason was teamed with Cole, the Red Wild Force Ranger. And Jason kept calling him Newbie. Oh my god. I, it was funny. Wow. Uh oh. This is my time Force! Age. Time Force, Time Force. So, the Pink Tower, Time Force Ranger and Red Quantum Ranger are on the same team? Yes. Right uh oh. No! Why, Jen? Jen is still a powerhouse. Oh my gosh, Jen is wrecking me! Oh my gosh, this Jen? is my Gold Ranger! She is literally coming after you right now. No! Gold Ranger down. Oh my gosh. What just happened? I just got wrecked, what that's what happened. What's going on with Jen? She's scared. Oh, they increased the arcade difficulty again. Okay. 
Yep. I think they did, actually. That's all right. We have Jason with us, so. He is. Oh. I have to say, I feel like he's the most powerful character on the board. With a close second to tri uh, Trini. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say something like close second to Trini? Ah! <laughs> no, I meant like, I meant Trini is a close second to him, that's what I meant to say. Maybe. I prefer Trini, as you know. Oh my gosh. Jen is just too fast. She's scary. Oh my gosh, Eric, that is so stylish, man! Sick. Yeah, he kind of fights almost like he is in Devil May Cry because his moves are like crazy styling. Oh man. Oh man, this is so cool! I'm not even a huge Time Force fan. I mean, I like Time Force. Uh oh. Uh no, Eric! Dang it! No. It's up to Jason. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, I mean, it must be a hugely popular popular show to have two rangers on it. Well, I mean, you have to remember. Again, it's an adaption of the Shattered Grid event, so. Um, oh, right, that makes sense. It makes sense that Jen is a huge part of the story, and even though she was part of the Season Pass 1 characters, she played a huge role. She was the one who went back in time and warned them about Lord Draken going to these different dimensions and destroying rangers and stealing their powers. Oh, okay. Like, if they ever make an animated series, they need to adapt that. That's yeah, what I would love to see. That would be awesome. So, Luke, for the next ranger that you want to see come out, do you want to see... I'll ask you in a second. Sorry. <laughs> Only death awaits you here, Ranger. I'm not just any Ranger, Goldar. Goldar, not by a long shot. I'm the Quantum Ranger. I'll crush you no matter who you are, fool. I'm not just any Ranger. Not by a long shot. <laughs> I wish they brought in his Q-Rex sword, though. That'd be cool. <laughs> but, I mean... His his super move I'm still adjusting to. You wanted it to look more flashy. I wanted it to be flashy and very time forcey, but I mean it's different. It's different than anybody else's because it gives him an entirely new move set. Mm. And I haven't really messed around enough to see if he has like an actual finisher or if yeah. it's just like, hey, I've got all these cool bells and whistles to my powers now. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh, Jason. So would the next ranger you'd really want to see would be Doggy Ranger? No, Doggy's already in it. Oh yeah, that's right, he is. Why am I saying weird things? I'm Amber's sorry. gonna have to read press releases before uh, she does videos. We did a whole thing on Shadow Ranger for two yeah, weeks. Yeah, you're right, we did. I'm sorry. It's okay. My mind is on the last thing we were doing. Sorry. My mind is on blonde mode. Oh. Well, I'm trying to think of the other rangers that are supposed to come out soon. Uh, Daichi is the next one. He's not really a ranger, though. Uh-oh. Ah! You would want to see Lauren in the game, though. Yes. Lauren would be and, fun. Uh, Coda? Yes, I would like Coda. Coda, Lauren. Um, I think Coda has a real shot because he's he was in the uh, ending of the game. Like... If you look at the different rangers that are in the story mode, like, he appears during Jason's, like, big, you know, rousing speech. So, it's a big possibility. Yeah. Definitely. Boom, baby. Uh-oh. I love the fact that he can go from... He's the only ranger that I can think of that really has a great balance between long range and close range combat. Because Jason, yeah, he can fire his blaster, but it's just like two shots, and it's kind of like a defensive thing. That thing packs a punch. I need more quantum power. You know? Mm -hmm. It's insane. Finish sequence. Okay, so the finish sequence is not tied together to the the quantum thing. That's okay. okay. I thought it was going to, but no. I got guns too. See, Jason's blaster looks like that. It's just kind of me. It's yeah. just kind of used to put some distance between you and the enemy. Whereas, oh, Gold Ranger, when it hits, but look, look at that. Look at the force of that. 
Yeah, I mean, Quantum Ranger is scary, forceful. And he can jump up in the air and do it, too. He looked really cool when he just jumped up and did That's that. from the show. That was awesome. I wanted one of his finishers to be from, like, his awesome thing that he does in the show. He does turn his gun into a sword, but there's, like, more of a flashy sequence to it. Awesome. Small potatoes. I have bigger plans than you. So, does the actor do his own, like, moves in the show, or is that, like, all a stunt? Actor? He's a martial artist. Wow, that's really That awesome. was, like, one of his first roles. So he does martial arts, he's an actor, and a voice actor. That's pretty awesome. Yep. He's also appeared in uh, Mortal Kombat as I'm a character as well. Wow. Not yeah. by a long shot. Like a... I think it was a Netflix series or something. That that's pretty awesome. I'm kind of upset that he only has one opening line, though. Yeah. Um, Gold Ranger had two. Lord Zed had, I think, one or two. Yeah. But yeah, guys, uh, White Ranger skin, I asked about it. I don't know when he's coming out. I want to say November. Mm, maybe they'll give him another line, like, later on or something? Mm, I don't think so. He probably already recorded all his lines, because he probably already has things to do. Well, he's touring conventions, like, all the time. Yeah. I mean, his audio sounds really clear and, like, really good. So. Oh, how'd I do that? Oh, my gosh! Awesome. Ow. I feel like it, once you and I, or once especially you, you're very good with it. Oh, Versus starts tomorrow, people. Learn to... Versus like, is tomorrow. Do more of his moves and... Okay, now I'm afraid to do Versus with you because... <laughs> You'll get to play as him, too. So this is, that's a super move. He does look cool, though. That looks good. Quantum Divide is mean, his attack. I mean, look, they can't make every ranger the best. I mean, you still want Jason to be the best, right? <laughs> I wanted Gold Ranger to be the best, but oh well. Yeah. Eric is really good. I mean, they're going to nerf him, but right now, oh my gosh. So he's really OP right now. Except there's only one ranger that I thought they were going to nerf, and they never have. Jen! Jen is oh. still, like, Jen top is, tier. Jen is too powerful. Like, she's ridiculous. There's no way she was, like... It feels like if... Like, if you have Jason, I feel like I can still beat you with Jen. Like, oh, yeah, you can... If like, you have your team of Trini, Jen, and some other people, help. Yeah, I mean, please don't nerf Trini, though, because... Guys, don't nerf Trini. Uh -oh. I love Trini. But you guys can nerf Jen. You can nerf Jen. I never want Trini to be nerfed because I think she's perfect the way she is. She can't really block very well because she's in a mech. She's She moves slowly. Oh, Eric goes down. The only ranger I really... I mean, there are a few rangers I still can't play very well. One of them is... um, Kim. Kimmy Cub? She is just really, for me, it's difficult for me to do her moves. It's hard, it's like slow for me. I get beat right away. Like, I can't even be on the screen for more than a few seconds as Kim. Before I'm completely destroyed. I feel like they already nerfed Gold Ranger a little bit. Yeah, I mean, look, if they had made it Austin, then... Um, if they had made it Jason, then, like... Then they wouldn't have nerfed him, I don't think. But because it's Trey, they nerfed him. I don't know. I mean, Jason, they keep improving, though. The Red Ranger, like... I'm I'm down with that. Yeah. I'm totally fine with that. I love that. I'm glad he's I mean, he's one of the, the most powerful characters He's the, the original. Game. Yeah, like, I love the fact that they keep adding new things for Jason. You were asking me what I would really like. I would love to have a skin for Jason's new um, Power Ranger. The, um, Omega Red Ranger. Like... Yeah. Actually, not a skin. I would love for him to be in the game because the moveset is completely different. Like, Jason has, like, superpowers with flames oh, and stuff yeah. now. Well, I mean, they have several Tommies in the game. Well, they're gonna have more Tommy skins from what I hear. The White Ranger skin is just the first of many. But I thought that, like, Hasbro's working more with Austin St. John now. They are. So why can't they have more Jasons in the game? Jason only has two Ranger forms. Gold Ranger, and now he has a third form, which is the Omega Ranger. Mm. You brought the power of the Q-Rex within my grasp, you utter fool. <laughs> 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 you would have to beat me to get it, and you won't. I'm not just any Ranger. Not by a long shot. 
<laughs> I like the I know. interaction between them. Don't, don't you love how confident Eric is, though? Yeah. Like, the quantum power is insane, but Eric is just like, just in the show, he didn't talk as much. He was like a more action based character yeah. in Time Force. It's so cool to hear him talking in this, yeah. A lot. And being just like trolling people with. His little catchphrases and stuff, it's awesome. I wanted more of his one-liners. He used to say fool. Um, he used to call people a fool. Oh. Which kind of he brought over to his Devil May Cry character. Oh, I see. Oh, he has an uppercut! Sweet! Well, if you Ow. think about it, I feel like... He Ow. probably puts a little bit of his own personality oh. into both of the characters he plays. Yep. But you have to follow uh, Daniel's um, Twitter because he does lots of fun stuff. Cool. Like, he got, he did something recently. Um, Jason, the um, red Time Force Ranger, like the, you know, the guy who Jen is in a relationship with in the show. Um, the actor, they have such like this comedic thing against each other. Some fan gave him a Quantum Ranger helmet to sign instead of a red Time Force thing. So Jason decided, okay, I'm gonna sign it, but he signed it right on the visor of the Quantum Ranger, and then he tagged Daniel. Oh my god. So essentially he ruined the visor with his giant signature on there. So instead of Eric's signature, which the guy probably was saving it for, he has, he has that his signature. Is so funny. I know, it's awesome. Wow. And Daniel responded too. It's just the interaction between these two rangers is just hilarious. Wow, that's fun. I love ranger fandom and the ranger actors are just they're all great. Well, it just feels like the Ow. like Daniel is having such a fun time saying his lines. Like you just get such like happy, like positive energy from him saying his things and stuff. And I'm sorry, guys. I, I was doing a story. That's why uh, I lost with Quantum Ranger. I feel bad. You're like me. When I get talking, I can like completely start losing. I mean, I think Eric is too technical a character for me. Like he's well, really fun to play, but this is my first time doing this. This is the first time Luke has picked it up and actually done it. I have a Fortnite stream today too, so yeah. I, I gotta I gotta book it. I also yeah. want to get this video up, so I'm rushing. Oh, you are a loop? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. I thought you were... Oh, sweet! Way to go, Jay! Alright, it's over, Tommy. And blast through to the face! It's over, Lord Draken! Oh. Nice! Oh. Whoa. He felt that one. Take it out swiftly. Swift justice. All right, Eric, come back and say something cool. Quantum power, you can't stop me. Okay. All right, and there you go, guys. That is the arcade for the Quantum Ranger. So tomorrow there will be a Power Rangers community stream, and our week of Quantum Ranger versus videos begins as well. Aya! So in the comment section below, tell us you want to see Quantum Ranger Eric Myers battle throughout the week in Power Rangers Versus. Yeah. And make sure you check out Eric, available now, at least on the Nintendo Switch, probably later tonight for the PS4, but don't quote me on that. And I believe the character is currently out on Steam and Xbox, since they tend to get the character first. But awesome. first impressions, he's a lot of fun to play. He has great balance between long range and close range combat. He has that cocky attitude that you would come to expect from Time Force, which <laughs> makes the character even more awesome yeah. and i just had so much fun playing him so i look forward to challenging you guys in my community stream tomorrow uh around six o'clock yeah so come back for that and we hope you guys will enjoy power rangers versus this awesome. has been eric myers time force quantum ranger arcade mode thanks so much for watching god bless and happy gaming may the power protect you always See you.